I like talking to you, Ophelia. But let me remind you that if I had to, I wouldn't have a problem cutting both their throats. Well, you'll never get them together. I'm the only one who can do that. Can you talk about preparing for a character who is as unorthodox in her approach to life as this? You know, it wasn't just like preparing for one character. It was it was really two characters because there's the O that you see on screen. Um, you see all of her actions and, and, and uh, how she goes through life. And then there's the O where you hear her thoughts, her ideals, her, her perception. And um, that's the voiceover. And um, the arc of, of O that you see versus the arc of O who's telling the story. You know, the O that tells the story in the beginning knows what's going to happen at the end, where the O that you see has no idea. So you're really balancing two different characters. So that was that was a huge struggle um, to try to um, find the arcs um, within each character. And, um, and you know, she's very unconventional, but that was what was exciting. And Oliver and I spent a lot of time looking at, at these young people and saying, why is their life like this? You look at these people that come from such new money, such wealth in, in Laguna, and, and their parents just leave them and, and, and go travel, and they're raised by nannies, but yet they're given cars and money, and, and they're given everything they could ever want, but nothing that they need. And so the, the ways in which that, that manifests itself and, and it turns out, you know, they find love, they create their own family and it ends up in the form of a relationship with, with three people. To me what's really fascinating about uh, this as an Oliver Stone film is how cleanly his sort of artistic style and, and the things that are important to him bookend with what Don had written originally. Like, it really feels like it is organic to Oliver's process. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Can you talk about him approaching the uh, the film on set and working with you guys? He's somebody that you will never have figured out. You think, like, oh, you're testing the waters. You think, oh, okay, that's how he is. I have him. But he is so unexpected. And, you know, I've, I've said he, he embodies everything that, the, that his movies are, you know. He will always give you a twist and, and shock you. He loves to shock people. He loves to create chaos. Mm -hmm. um, yet he also likes that calm, stoic center, which is him in, in the chaos that he creates. Um, and he loves to challenge people. Um, he's so full of, of testosterone and passion and love and, you know, he really feeds all of that into each character and 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 the, not only his work ethic but but you know the characters that that he helps us create